Hey everyone, Matt here. So it's June 11th, and today we've been artificially swarming our queens. We have one more hive to go. It's the Lands East Hive here. And we're gonna take her out of there and put her into the brown section of our new retrofitted Gertrude Hive there. So the weather's not too good today. Uh, let's get to it. So I've already got it opened, if you watched the last one there when we artificially swarmed the West Hive. I did leave a little gap there, so I imagine that um, cross combing that was there before, the uh, that was on the division board, is probably a little bit worse now. But uh, let's get into it. We can see in the distance there, the rain shower over there, so we need to be quick here. Yeah. Oh yeah. Look at that one, all honey there. Let's squish them a little bit. They still have all that. The queen relayed brood all in this section right here, which is kind of kind of weird. Because you think that that would be <coughs> kind of the honey section there in the back. But let's just... That does got a bunch of one-year-old and stuff. Or one-year-old, one-day-old larvae and younger. So we'll leave that one in there. Let's look for the queen here. A lot of bees on that one. Just touch them a little bit to see if they'll move out of the way, if the queen's in there. I don't really see her on that one. So let's, uh, let's just set them down here for a sec. Oh boy. That's some issues there. Oh. Oh boy. It's not the day to be fooling around with this. So that's all laid out. Yeah, it's like that comment from Greg V there where he says he's got a, a lot of problem with <laughs> double combing when they have the inch and a half size frames there and this hive seems to be struggling with that. So I don't see the queen in that one. Oh yeah, it's a mess. I'll show you on the next one here. Whoop. It's all brewed on this side. You can see on this where they Last comb and I assume that it was out like that into the land frame beside it. Let's just see if we can just kind of snap that off. Whoop. We'll just set this down here and let them kind of crawl off that. Let's take a quick peek for the queen. Oh, 
Well, I don't see her in that one. So let's just throw that back in there a little bit. And then these ones should be pretty good. This is the uh, original frames from Mark where they're pretty tight. Uh, this one's got brood and she's relaying on the outside there, so she could be here. We are running out of time. Let's throw this back down here. Oh man. It's starting to drizzle. So I gotta close this up really quick like. Cause they will not and then we'll have to continue on this when the the rain goes by. that so oh. uh, let's just pull this out a little bit you can see Actually, I hope the cleans out on that one you can see all the comb that they put on there let's try and get this as tight as possible Come on. I wanted it tight. There we go. So let's put this back in here. Yeah, we need to close this up. Because it's raining. Oh, man. PIA. I'm going to get stung for sure. That down. Yeah, I'm going. I'm going. Okay. Let's get this going. We get in there. Sorry, ladies. Ugh. So let's just. These are gonna have to go down to the front of the hive there. Okay. Yeah, that's rain. Okay, let's get this on here quick. Okay, looks like we have a break in the weather here. So let's see if we can just get this done really quick like. Still gotta locate the queen. Okay, I don't see her on that one. Let's just set this one down here just for a little bit. This one, I don't know why I put this one on this side. 
Probably should have been at the front of the hive there. So yeah, if I don't find her this time, then we'll just do a walkaway split and split them in half. And then whichever one doesn't have the queen, we'll figure it out because she will uh, be the only one that's still making brood. Maybe we should do that anyways. So that's what we'll do. Actually, hold on. Smoke. Yeah, that's what I'll do. So I'll just open this up. Uh, so this one has a bunch of resources, honey at the top, sealed brew. There's some new larvae here. New eggs, young eggs, so if they need to make a new queen. So we'll throw this one on this side first. We're gonna just don't want to get some of these. First I wanna put a frame in here up against the wall. So this is the same, it's got all fresh larvae in there. Fresh larvae, so we'll throw this one in here. So yeah, this one's got some new eggs and larvae. And this one, and it's one of the lands ones, so we can just Keep them in here, so I'll throw this one back in here. First what I'm going to do is I'm going to um, put in a new frame to go on this side of the, uh, to go on this side of the brood nest. A new frame. Close this one up. So let's show this one. Show it. Oh, here's the queen right here. So we can actually stop looking, I guess. There she is right here. See if we can get some light on there. There she is right on the top there. So I guess we'll just throw her in this one. Do you want to see it? I see her. Okay, so now we got the queen for sure. Let's just make sure that I left enough open brood in here. We already do have one big frame. Let's get this in the sun. So yeah, there's one's new eggs, new cells. I'm sure they'll be fine. So let's just put another frame. We'll slide these over till we get... Actually, let's... I don't want to get rid of these ones here, so we'll put this 
lands one back in the front here. Back with the other lanes there. There we go. There we go. Let's just put one more. Just right up in there, so I have lots of room. Then we'll just close them up. This is gonna get right with Jamie. Oh, I forgot one. Almost forgot this one. That's funny. Just smoke them to drive them down. go okay so let's just put another one of these new frames in here just in case they want to expand a little bit more than that one frame in the front put some wax in there put this new Division board up. Perfect. Oh, it's a little wobbly bobbly. And I got the new top cover for this, which hopefully stays on. There we go. Okay, looks like good timing because I think here comes the rain clouds again. But we'll just open the front entrance and then put the lid on, we'll be done. Okay, we'll just leave them at half open there, just because they're a smaller colony, and uh, we're done. <laughs>